F1 drivers are unhappy with the FIA as tensions begin to spill over at the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. Lewis Hamilton, Sebastian Vettel and other F1 stars are not happy with the FIA as dissatisfaction builds in the paddock after a series of issues this season. BBC Sports Andrew Benson told Radio 5 Live, yesterday in the press conference, drivers were asked are you happy and satisfied with the way the FIA president and the FIA are running the sport. None of them wanted to answer, it was really awkward. Long story short, no one is really happy with the fear at the moment. The issue comes after a series of disagreements this season have angered teams and drivers. The fear were criticized for their handling of the Monaco Grand Prix after delaying the start due to light rain. Benson claims teams were asked to fit extreme wet tires just minutes before the start causing pandemonium on the grid. He also suggested teams were told they needed to fit full wet tires at the second start 20 seconds after the cut-off time for the tires to be fitted. Benson added, it's a joke and the teams are not happy about it. It feeds into this thing that we have been talking about for a few races now, a general dissatisfaction at the way the FIA is conducting itself on a number of different levels. FIA President Mohamed Ben Salem was recently slammed for comments he made about Lewis Hamilton and Sebastian Vettel. He suggested drivers should not be pushing their views on others after both Hamilton and Vettel have openly campaigned on the human rights issues. Ben Salem said, Now, Vettel drives a rainbow bicycle, Lewis is passionate about human rights, and Norris addresses mental health. Everybody has the right to think. To me, it is about deciding whether we should impose our beliefs in something over the sport all the time. The fear was forced to backtrack on this, with Ben Saleh M claiming he has always believed in using sports as a catalyst for progress in society. Last month, the fear refused to put a barrier in at Miami's turn 13 after Carlos Sainz crashed on Friday. The Spaniard raised the issue at the driver's briefing but was told no action would be taken. Esteban Ocon then crashed at the same corner on Saturday, leaving drivers such as Lando Norris to call out the FIA's mistake. The governing body has also been embroiled in a lengthy debate with drivers over jewellery with Vettel claiming Hamilton had been targeted. F1 team bosses also asked for six sprint races ahead of the season to cash in on some of the sport's new interest. However, it is understood this was blocked by the FIA who demanded extra money as compensation for running a race instead of a practice session. This all comes just months after the fiasco at the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix which left many questioning the sport's fairness.